We are stepping into a country during emergencies to support in preparedness, readiness and response. And we always do it when we are invited by the government. In Tajikistan, we were asked to support the country and a day before the mission was assembled with our partners, we already were notified by the Ministry of Health of the first cases in the country. In this way, right away, we changed the scope of the mission to support the country in assessing the situation and preparing them with all the details that are needed for the response. Our experts joined in different areas, in essential services delivery, in uh, healthcare management, laboratories, logistics, surveillance, and every aspect that is needed in each of the countries. So in Tajikistan specifically, we joined the country office. When this mission left and went to another mission, we backed it up with experts that keep coming and going and escalating the response in the country. We already see the results and are so glad to work with the Tajik authorities and the experts. Since uh, Moises Air uh, WHO uh, has been uh, providing technical support to the COVID-19 uh, response uh, operation in Tajikistan. Correct and timely WHO assistance in a pandemic a uh, very important, especially for Tajikistan as a country with a developing health system. This is not a typical mission because we do not take care of the patients directly. Uh, we are, as we call it, shadowing the local personnel, the local medical staff, which means that we support them in day daily work, working with them hand to hand at the patient's beds. So for us, it's also a great lesson how the Tajik medical personnel is doing in these difficult times what are their experiences, what are their problems, and what solutions they have. We were not ready to respond to COVID-19 in February, yet we work every week, every month to adapt to the new challenges. We hope that we provide the best assistance possible. We know we are not ideal because none of us across the world has the complete package of experience, but we try to put together all the experience that we can from Italy, from Poland, from Kyrgyzstan, and put it at the disposal of doctors and the medical system here in Tajikistan. You know, the world is very big, and uh, in emergency situation, the support provided by neighboring countries can make a big difference. Having training teams and equipment on the ground allows to save precious time and to support those in need. Within the deployment of the Global Outbreak uh, Alert and Response Network, GUARN, we enable access to PCR testing in the remote areas of Pamir region in gorno badakhshan Autonomous uh, Oblast in Tajikistan. The comprehensive approach to COVID-19 response in Tajikistan covers key critical areas. In addition to providing hands-on expertise in clinical care, the Bolincho and our partners mobilize specialists from Germany, the Russian Federation and the United Kingdom to support the public health laboratories and surveillance systems in the country. Over the last few months, WHO and partners have supplied 38 tons of medical and laboratory supplies and personal protective equipment and provided aid of laboratories with training. The WHO country office continues to work with national and international partners to keep patients and medical workers safe.